So unfortunately, guys, this little man does not come on my videos for free anymore. I have to pay him in treats for every single one. He doesn't come on him at all for free. He says no free, uh, no free content. And, uh, you know, I kind of respect the grind. I respect the hustle. He only gets paid in treats. No, he doesn't take money. Isn't that right? Is that the good stuff? I think that's the good stuff. So, guys, some big news, actually. Um, I thought I'd just kind of do a little update video. Talk about some things going forward with the channel and with my life, everything like that. I like to do these every couple of months to keep you guys updated. Keep any new people in the loop as well. Any new people that have joined recently. Um, I'm getting him a sister. He's getting a sister. He is clearly bothered right now. <laughs> wants to go down. But yeah, his sister's actually been born. Coming from the United Kingdom. Um, it's, I'm not going to have the dog until maybe September or so. Because it has to be 16 weeks before it can travel into the country from the United Kingdom. Right now, I believe it's only two or three weeks old. It was born June 8th, actually. So it's more than that. It's nearly a month old now at this point. So um, in another three months, it will be with me. So I won't show you guys too much because they're still really young and developing, but uh, look how cute they are. I'll show you guys the parents because the parents, uh, you'll kind of get a feel for what the dogs will be like. Here is the mother and father together. Look at that for a cute couple pick, by the way. The father's an absolute tank. Look at him there. He's a beast. So um, yeah, Northern Inuit. It's the they played the Dire Wolves in Game of Thrones. I'm really excited about getting a new dog, getting Loki a little buddy. Uh, should be fun. It's going to be a, a lot of work. So I'm thinking of creating content around this new dog. Actually, this bitch, as they call them. Um, I wouldn't call them that because that's just backwards. All right. No, but for real, I'm thinking about maybe um, getting into the TikTok scene. I don't know too much about it, but I think uh, there's a lot, a lot of uh, successful dog accounts on there, as well as Instagram. So I'm thinking about creating an Instagram account and a TikTok account focused around the dogs. I think that would be something that I'd enjoy, something that uh, would be fun. Um, obviously, none of you guys have to come along for that venture, but something separate that I'll be doing outside of YouTube. It's something I thought about for a while with Loki as well, but I think with the new one coming in, it would be... It would be the perfect time. People love puppies, you know, so I love puppies. It won't be that young when it's coming to me. It would, it would be 16 weeks, which is four months, which is pretty big at that stage. But uh, regardless, I think um, I think it's something that I'm, I'm kind of interested in doing. So I'm going to give it a shot. I don't know too much. As I said, I don't know too much about the TikTok scene. So I'll maybe get some help with that. Maybe my girlfriend can help me out, something like that. I don't, I don't know. We'll, uh, we'll see how it goes. Also, I wanted to put it out there, if anyone watching this is a graphic designer or you know someone that's a graphic designer, I am looking to kind of get new channel art for this main channel. I'm looking to get a new logo, maybe a new banner as well. Um, I thought I had something, but it's kind of fell through. I'm looking around. I'm kind of um, seeing what's out there. But if anyone from my community is involved, send me, a, send me your portfolio or something. It would be cool. Um, you can hit me up on Instagram or Twitter. My links for all that are in the description. You can also join the Discord. There's a link for that down in the description as well. Also, guys, if you didn't know, you probably do by now, but I'm sponsored by Rogue Energy now. I've got a full sponsorship, 20% off. You can get using my code, the Apex Sound, or else using the link down below in the description also. Lots of links down in the description that you can click on for your leisure. But now, let's get into the meat of why you're probably here, the video games. So, PGA content will be going forward, unabated I will be doing my TGC Tours content, the Olympics content, and the Fantasy Course of the Week. Once the Olymp- the Olympics will probably be wrapping up this month actually, I would assume, in July, towards the end of July, the Olympics will be wrapping up, um, or maybe it'll run into August. We'll see how that goes, but uh, we're on the last event now, the All Shot event. Um, we're going to be playing um, our match. Me and Alex are playing our first All Shot match on Monday morning, well, Monday afternoon, um, UK time. So fans of PGA, fear not, I will be continuing with that. Uh, streams, videos, all the good stuff. Mario Golf, I know there's another, a lot of new people around here from Mario Golf. I will be continuing that too. I think I'm actually going to finish up the story mode today, but I will be focusing on more stuff than that. We're going to try some online play. We're going to try some random rounds with like Mario, with Luigi. I think that could be pretty fun. Um, I might have a match lined up with Genie, another YouTuber. Could be a... Could be a lot of fun. MLB just uploaded a video today, actually. I got my first, uh, no, I won't spoil it. I got my first Cubs home run. Just spoil it. Never mind. Um, but uh, go check it out. I had a lot of fun with that one. Um, uh, also, second channel. Please, guys, subscribe to the second channel, okay? The Apex Sound 2. I won't even call it a second channel. I'll call it my other channel now because I am doing 
more gameplay focused stuff on that like uh, story games all of that i will be doing the ascent over there in july i'm continuing on with fifa over there as well and uh, possibly mass effect as well if the support is there i want to do a full series on mass effect 2 the legendary edition so make sure you make your way over there i'll be doing lots of games over there in the future here on the main channel um i will be doing pga mario mlb um the olympics game i want to do a few more videos on that as well because i'm enjoying that and it's doing pretty well and then for new games coming onto the channel this month i think i'm gonna do flight sim so uh, i've been waiting a long time to play this game i tried to play it on pc it just wouldn't work for me it kept crashing i was having major problems with it but uh, it's coming out on xbox in the end of july at the end of july july 27th i believe and i have my xbox series x here waiting to go waiting for flight sim um i will be definitely doing some content on that maybe just some really fun type videos where i fly from ireland to norway where i was born and kind of just if you guys have any um suggestions as well i'd be 100 percent down with them and finally, I just want to say a massive thank you to you all. I'm actually really happy with where my content is at at the moment. I'm really happy with where everything is is going. Um, I think I have a good balance with the main channel and the other channel as well. Uh, I think that just overall, I'm feeling good about the future of the Apex Hound. I do want to, as I said, get new logo, get new channel art, maybe new merch in the, in the near future as well. Um, there's lots of big plans in the future for new types of games. Uh, both here and on the Apex Hound 2. So uh, make sure you subscribe to both. Make sure you support in both. Make sure you follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I'll post updates on there. Mainly Twitter. I use Twitter quite a bit. And uh, I'm always lurking in the Discord as well and posting in there. It's interesting though because like the sub growth isn't exactly where I'd want it to be. The views are pretty decent. But uh, the watch time is what I've been most impressed with. You guys stick around and watch my videos you really enjoy the content and that's what i'm really happy with at the moment i've been getting like 15 to 25 minutes watch time on most of my videos which is insane compared to what i used to be getting um so i really appreciate that people stick around and uh actually watch the videos all the way through to the end and if you're one of those people right now at this moment in the video then i'm gonna give you a free watch no i'm just kidding this costs too much money so you get nothing the Euros is on tonight as well. England are playing, uh, I was about to say Belgium. England are playing Ukraine and Denmark are playing Czech Republic before that. So it should be a couple of good games. Uh, I'm going for Denmark win and an England win, I think. But uh, it would be funny if Ukraine won after all the hype with England now after they beat, uh, after they beat the Germans. The Germans! But I think Italy are going to win it all, 100%. I think Italy are winning it all. They're the favorites now that, uh, that they beat Belgium, 100%. Also, Ricky Fowler's doing well in the golf. It's good to see. Um, he holed out, uh, I, I quote retweeted it on Twitter yesterday, but he holed out from an incredibly tough lie and angle. It was a beautiful golf shot, I gotta say. I'm golfing in real life tomorrow. I do really, really, really want to bring back real life golf content as well. And that's what I was talking about with the future of the channel, that I'm really excited about some things that are coming up. I'm 100% going to Sweden by the way, and I'm going to play around a real-life golf round with Alexander, my partner from PGA Tour 2K21. That's something that is on the cards. 100% we're going to do that. We're going to play maybe a couple of courses in Sweden or something. Um, I'm not sure exactly when we'll be able to travel um, and when I'll be able to get over there, but hopefully sometime this year. That would be awesome. And not in the dead of winter when Sweden is covered in fucking snow, you know? Also, guys, this was one thing I did want to bring up as well. Names for the new puppy. I know most of you are probably already gone off this video, but names for the new puppy. I have some written down here. It is a female, as I said. But, like, I got a list of puppy names here that I really like. I've narrowed it down to, like, five or six names. So, Akalia is one. Indigo, I really like Indigo. That's probably, like, in my top two at the moment. Uh, Ember, that's also in my top two. Ember, not Amber, by the way. And that's the one thing kind of holding me back from 100% saying, yeah, Ember is awesome, is a lot of people will be like, Amber? I'm like, no, it's fucking Ember, dude. Um, but Ember, uh, Tundra, I like. Artemis, I like. Cirilla, I like. Witcher style, you know. And Fenrir. Uh, Fenrir... Kind of more of a boy's name, but I think it works for a girl as well, honestly. So that's something that I've been thinking on. Uh, this was kind of just a random ramble video, I know. Um, but I, I like sitting down and kind of just discussing shit with you guys. Everton Football Club as well. Rafa Benitez actually uploaded an Everton video talking about that on the, on the Apex Hound 2 yesterday. So if you want to go check that out, you can. Um, 
talked about this man too, James Rodriguez, sitting on my uh, my home screen. Let me show you. There he is. The beautiful man. And I'm, I'm going to miss him if he leaves. I hope he stays for one more season. Fabrizio Romano said he might stay for one more season, though. So hopefully Fab is right. That would be great. Also, guys, I was watching the new gameplay for Dying Light 2 yesterday, and this game looks awesome. It comes out in December. 100% full playthrough coming on one of the channels. I'm not sure which in December, whenever that whenever that launches. Uh, but let me know if there's any games you're interested in me playing coming up in the next couple of months. If you have any questions at all, leave them down below. I'm 100% going to be going through the comments and answering questions and uh, looking over whatever you guys have to say, maybe feedback on the channel, whatever you think. How do you think that the split has gone between the two channels? Do you think I'm doing a good job balancing them? Um, I feel like there's still more work to be done in terms of really separating the two. And uh, But recently, I, th I feel like I found a good balance. And the thing will be, the challenge will be when all the big games start coming out later this year. That's what I'm going to have to keep a balance that's going to be a lot more difficult. Maybe I'll have to put some of the sports stuff to the side while I'm playing through a lot of the story games. As I said, I will be picking like one or maybe even two big story games to play on this channel. And then on the other channel, Apex Sound 2, I'll be doing a lot more um, games over there as well. So uh, it will take some time to really kind of differentiate the two and, and find that balance that I want. But uh, I'm happy with where we're at right now. I really am. And uh, I hope you guys are happy with the content on the channel recently. Let me know what you think. I'll see you guys in the very near future for more content. Peace out. It's been a pleasure to serve you all.